I'm here with Logan Tobias, the Buffalo Junior Sabres, number 15, after a 7-1 seven? Seven to one. Seven to one win over uh, Syracuse Stars 18U. Logan, I'm not sure how many points you had. I'm assuming at least one. So what's the mindset when you know you got a big one on Saturday against Northwood? I mean... They played, they played well today. They played hard. Kind of sloppy on our end for the first period. You being the best player on the team and the most skilled, <laughs> what, do you, what, what, what goes through your mind in a game like that? Uh, just taking it one, one step at a time, you know, just doing the right things, getting pucks deep, taking the body if it's there. You know, trying not to give up two on O's. That's a big one, especially against a team like that. You know, they blew it by the net, but, you know, what? we're just taking it one step at a time. Okay. Uh, now, the goal they scored, were you out there? No. no. Thoughts on the goaltending today from your team and the defensive play? All 15 saves. All 15. 15 saves, is that what they had? 15 saves. 15 shots. I wake up this morning. 16. I wake up this morning, 6.45 a.m. Syracuse. Three, four shots. Maybe, if I'm lucky. 15 shots I took. 16 shots. 15 saves. You wake up at 7 in the morning, are you expecting that? I don't think so. Anyways, what did you think of the goaltending today? What did you think of the defense? Go. I uh, thought it was solid, the goaltending-wise. I mean, defense, we had a few, uh, few mental laps, especially 2-on-0 late in the third. Yeah, it was. I mean, we're up 7-1, but bad pitch. Josh Dressler, by the way. At what point, at what point, do you start reeling, thinking, we have to do this for our goalie save percentage? Obviously, myself and Mitch, all season, we haven't gotten many games off, if any. Every game we have played, it seems like we're taking shots. What can you guys do to finally help out your goalies and say, you know what, we'll give them three shots this game? I mean, just not go through the motions in our own end, I think. I think that's the biggest thing. Just getting pucks deep, you know, keeping it in their end, cycling it, working them down. I think that's it. And uh, last question, was the family here today? Of course. How many points did you have? I had one, probably had three. They don't give them to me, though. You know, Cliff steals them, so. Oh, Thank you. Oh, it was all right. Again, I mean, could have done better. We, we only won seven to one. Um, does your family approve of the performance? One point, Syracuse, seven to one, game one, 920 in the morning. They don't want to be here, most likely. No. They see you put up one point. What's going through their mind? What happens at the house tonight? What do they say to you on the car ride home? Um, I think they're going to be a little disappointed. They're going to tell me I need to you know, wake up for the next game. It's not going to be as easy. Got to just get back out there, you know, keep moving my feet. They're definitely going to be highly disappointed. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna okay. to that. say that. Thank you, uh, West Seneca native Logan Tobias. Thank you. Uh, shout out West Seneca East, West West High School. I was there the other day for the SAT as an 18-year-old. Beautiful facility. Um, Great campus. So shout out West Seneca. And also, uh, one last thing. This being the last Icing the Fed, we wanted to thank Melissa for everything she's done um, around Buffalo, both Fed hockey and, and for us. So. Uh, it's been fun. Logan? Yeah, just thank you for everything you've done. Always a pleasure seeing you around the rank. Always in a great mood. Just thanks for everything. Yeah, that's it.